For the people who witnessed it, it's an image they wish they could forget, but probably never will. Early this morning, a Florida man threw his five-year-old daughter off the Sunshine Skyway Bridge. Local 12 Sydney Benter looks at the tragedy and what we've learned about the man's bizarre behavior. I always called her my angel baby from the first moment I petted her little nose when she came out of my stomach. And now she really is my angel baby. Michelle Kerr is mourning the loss of her five-year-old daughter, Phoebe. She admits she and her little girl's father, John Johnchuk Jr., had an abusive relationship, but she didn't think he'd ever hurt their little girl. She's safe, but I guess I should have done something before. Someone did try to do something before, though. A lawyer called 911 after John Chuck stopped by her office the day before witnesses say he threw his daughter off a bridge. I was supposed to file his paperwork today for, for, for a case. He's like, well, don't file the paperwork. It's not going to matter anymore. Hours after that call, an off-duty police officer noticed John Chuck speeding by and followed him onto the bridge. But by the time he reached him, it was too late. I've been doing this job for 29 years. And I don't even know what was going through this guy's mind. A little insight came in court as the man accused of killing his own daughter faced a judge. Would you like me to hire an uh, appoint an attorney to represent you? No. Are you sure? I want to leave it in the hands of God. Sydney Benter, Local 12 News. And police say John Chuck has been arrested several times before. Now he is charged with first-degree murder.